All right, guys. Roman Marcianti, um, if you want some great film breakdowns on Rhett Lashley, um, on Derek King, and he's got more coming, uh, just hit YouTube, type in Roman Marcianti, M-A-R-C-I-A-N-T-E. It's on the screen for you. Make sure you check him out. Show my guy some love here. Okay, Ro, let me ask you this. Uh, what are your thoughts on Tyler Van Dyke? I know a lot of people are high on him. Um, have you had a chance to really look at his high school tape, and what's your opinion on him? Yeah, also, yeah, on my YouTube page as well, if you just scroll back down, there was a, it was a basically rolled out the red carpet for Tyler Van Dyke once he signed his papers. Uh, so it was, it's, it's, it's on there. So I, I've broken down his game as well. Um, you know, obviously going to piggyback from my boy over there at Kane's Insight, Lance Roffers, who ran his analytic and, and athletic testing numbers. He, he, believe it or not, he tested very closely to Deshaun Watson. So, like, he has got some athleticism, and I can I could tell it, you know, I can tell the listeners, I can tell you right now. The only reason why he didn't run that much in high school, and I have it on good authority, is because they just did not want the kid to get hurt. But when you do see him take off, he's he's mobile enough that he can go ahead and keep teams honest. Now, you know, our little birdies, been watching him down there on the, on the green tree, on the gable, little seven-on-seven seven drills. I hear he's killing it. I hear he's absolutely slaying it. So it's not surprising. The kid's got a, a great skill set. He has a great arm. He's got the athleticism. He's got the prototypical build. He's an effortless thrower. And, you know, one of the most remarkable things I thought about him, I mean, I'm really, you know, I have a baseball acumen too. I played the game. Uh, and, man, I can find a baseball playing quarterback really, really fast because they get this variant arm like action and angle. And, and, you know, he was just so repeatable and it just blew my mind because it took me like a whole season worth of film to finally say, Oh, there's the baseball tendency that you normally see. He's just naturally gifted to throw a football, real repeatable delivery. Uh, I, I'm very, I'm very high on him. Uh, you know, I was, when they were when he first came out after junior year film, and I think it's because of the Connecticut vibe that you know a lot of these hot beds right now for quarterbacks at Georgia, Texas, California, Florida. Well, nah, Florida's creeping up, but you know they, it's like this kid's four star all day. This is like you know three, and then shortly after, you know, all the four star ratings are coming out, you know, deservedly so because the, the kids definitely got the good. So I mean, this is a perfect storm. It's a perfect setup for TVD. You have a one-year guy in De'Eric King who, in all intents and purposes, is your QB1. You can go ahead and learn the system, assimilate to this system. He's probably going to go ahead and create some transfer casualties of his own by bringing in somebody like De'Eric King. you got to assume, if it hasn't happened already, that maybe one or two or three of our quarterbacks are going to hit the portal. Uh, and that way it's going to clear the path for you know Tyler Van Dyke in the future to go ahead and secure a starting spot in 2021 and beyond. 